ஹலோ குட் மார்னிங் மை டியர் சில்ட்ரன் ஹவ் பாலிஃபி ஆஃப் ஃபைன் தோல்ட் அண்ட் டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு ஸ்டடி அபவுட் த ஹவு டு மேக் மேக்னெட்ஸ் ஓகே த மேக்கிங் ஆஃப் மேக்னெட்ஸ் ஓகே டாபிக் இஸ் மேக்கிங் ஆஃப் மேக்னெட்ஸ் அண்ட் வி லேர்ன் அபவுட் ஹவு டு மேக் எ மேக்னெட் today we are going to discussing about the most convenient method to make a magnet an iron or a steel strip or a bar may be magnetized by rubbing with a permanent magnets okay there are two methods namely single touch method of magnetization and also the double touch method of magnetization these are the main two steps of magnetization okay and also the uh, passes uh, pass the electricity through the magnets we can also magnetize the magnets today we are discussing about these two types of magnetization that is single touch method and double touch method okay let's move to the class first method of magnetization is single touch method this method of magnetization of uh, iron or a steel bar by rubbing a single bar magnet again against the is called the single touch method of magnetization clear this is a single uh, using this this method is um, um applied only using a single bar magnet touch the single ma- uh, bar magnet on the iron or a steel rod or a steel strip repeat and repeat um again on the single po- uh, single direction we can magnetize a iron or a steel rod or a steel strip okay this method of magnetization is known as single touch magnetization okay uh, to shows uh, and uh, to do an activity to show the single touch method of magnetization the materials are mainly required for this activity a thin strip of iron or a steel and a wooden table and a bar magnet okay take the thin strip and mark uh, the one end is a and other is b of the uh, iron piece okay and place the strip near and edge of the wooden table and take a strong bar magnet place the north pole on the bar magnet at the end of a strip and rub and drag the magnet along the entire length of the strip up to the end b now lift the bar magnet again place the north pole and magnet at ends a repeat the dragging process at least 40 to 50 times the strips get magnetized the magnetization of the strip can be checked by using small iron pins or the iron fillings etc okay the strips are attracts through them we can observe that end a of the tip strip behaves as north pole and of the magnet end of the b as the south pole clear let's watch the video related to this activity how to make a magnet let us learn the most convenient method to make a small magnet this is called single touch method take a piece of material to be magnetized like an iron bar on a flat surface then take the bar magnet and hold it in an inclined position in such a way that one of the poles of the magnet touches the iron bar Rub the bar magnet over the surface of the iron bar from one end 
till the other end. Then lift and place it back at the start position. Repeat the process several times in the same way and make sure to rub in one direction only. Then turn the bar magnet upside down and repeat the process again several times in the same manner. If the process of rubbing the bar magnet over the iron bar is done correctly, then the iron bar gets magnetized. The starting point gets the same polarity as the pole of the bar magnet touching it, while the other side gets the polarity opposite to that of the magnetizing pole. Now bring the magnetized iron bar near small iron pins. You will observe that the pin gets attracted towards the magnet and sticks to it. This shows magnetism has been induced in it. The more times you rub the permanent bar magnet over your iron bar, the more powerful your magnet will become. The next method is double touch method of magnetization. This method of magnetization of iron steel or a iron or steel bar by rubbing two bar magnets against is known as double touch method of magnetization. Okay, all of you clear? We use two bar magnets for this method. Okay, uh, let's do an activity to show the double touch method of magnetization. Okay, the materials required for this activity is our a thin strip of bar magnet or a strip or bar of the iron or steel and also a wooden table and identical bar magnets strong and identical bar magnets okay then take a thin strip bar and mark a and b on the both ends and um, the um, place the strip on the wooden table okay Take the identical bar magnets, uh, places south pole on the one uh, magnet and um, south pole of one magnet and north pole of the other magnet at the midpoint of the strip or the bar. Rub and drag the two magnets against the strip. Take one magnet at the end A and other magnet to the end B. Okay, as shown on this figure. Okay, now lift the bar magnets and again put them at the midpoint of the strip and repeat and drag this process at least 40 to 50 times. Okay, thus the strip AB gets magnetized and uh, strip uh, A act as a, a south pole and the uh, B end of the strip act as a now the pull. Clear? Okay. Let's watch a video related to that. Double touch method. Place a steel bar to be magnetized on two bar magnets as shown here. Now place opposite poles of two strong magnets at the middle of the steel bar as shown here. Move the magnets towards the opposite ends of the specimen, keeping the magnets inclined. On reaching the opposite ends, lift the magnets and place them back to their respective original positions. Repeat the process. The polarities developed at the ends are opposite to the polarity of the pole used for magnetization. 
Place some iron nails on the table. Now bring the steel bar near the iron nails. The steel bar attracts the nail showing that it has acquired magnetism.